Hey, what is good on? This is Rob from Panther. Today we're gonna check it out some really cool transparency tricks in Illustrator. First step, let's select the type tool which is located here. Click, I'm gonna type in the letter S. I'm gonna press and hold Shift plus Alt, scale it up. And I'm gonna choose a font and I'm gonna go with the pop-ins. I'm gonna select extra light. I'm gonna go to the object, expand, click OK. And we're gonna add some nice gradients. And I'm gonna click on this. If you double click on the circle, you can choose a color. I'm just gonna go with CMYK. If I press and hold Alt, you can duplicate these little circles and this way you can add like more colors. And there you go. You also can select the letter S, press the letter G and you know, adjust the gradient on this. All right, let's go to the effects, distort and transform, transform. And I'm gonna add a lot of copies. I don't know, thinking about like 30. And we got the horizontal and vertical. I'm gonna decrease it somewhere around here, 94 by, actually I gotta make it 97, something like this. I'm gonna also check it out the horizontal and vertical to see what happens if I distort this. I gotta do it like this. It looks pretty inter interesting. I'm gonna click OK. All right, select it, go to object, go to expand appearance, right click on group, right click on group again. And we're gonna go to the blend mode. If you don't have the transparency, you can go to Windows and select the transparency. We're gonna click on here and select multiply. It's gonna blend in the colors really cool, make it transparent, add some really cool effects. And this was it. Thanks for watching. And if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates and also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a good one. Bye bye.